everyone, my name is Heather and welcome back to my channel. Uh, if the lighting looks really weird, I'm really sorry. Um, it's like I'm losing my light and I don't want to wait to film this video because this stuff, we need to get it out of the house. <laughs> and my husband's going to take it to donation tomorrow or most of it to donation tomorrow. So I just want to film it so we can get it and load it up in his car. And yeah, so if the light's weird, I'm so sorry. But this is going to be the first video in a series that I want to start doing on this channel and that is what I'm decluttering this month. So this is the only month it's going to be a little bit inaccurate <laughs> because we've been kind of collecting this stuff for a few months. But in general, it's going to be a little bit less stuff and every month I'm just going to let you know the things that I am getting rid of. So starting off, I'm going to talk about DVDs. We just went through our DVDs. Uh, about a week ago because we don't really watch a lot of our DVDs and or any of them to be honest so we are getting rid of the vast majority of our DVDs now we don't want to just declutter these because a lot of them are really they're brand new so I kind of want to sell them for like I don't know five bucks or something um, maybe some of them for a little bit more like the first one I talk about because it's a trilogy uh, put together <laughs> but yeah, so I don't know. I'm deliberating on whether to try and sell them if any of you guys want them. I have Venmo, so if you guys want to buy any of these DVDs, let me know. And I don't know. Let me know. Maybe we can start DMing on Twitter or something and figure that out because I think we can make a little bit of money off of these, right, babe? Yeah, he's nodding. So I'm going to go through these pretty quickly. I'm not going to explain why we're getting rid of them. Some of you are going to be shocked. But hey, that's how it is, all right? Just gonna go through them. We are getting rid of our Star Wars <laughs> DVDs. These are, um, it's like the original trilogy, A New Hope, The Empire Strikes Back, and Return of the Jedi. It's Blu-ray and DVD, by the way, um, just so you know, if any of you wanna buy it from us. Um, yeah, so getting rid of that. Jurassic Park, the Indiana Jones, like trilogy, the first three, not the fourth one. We don't own the fourth one. Independence Day, Jack Reacher, getting rid of Jerry Maguire, Dr. Horrible's Sing Along Blog, Monty Python and the Holy Grail, Breakfast at Tiffany's, Julie and Julia, and Taken. This is not even open. The Mission Impossible movies, we have the first four, three of which aren't even opened. Yeah, we have a lot of Tom Cruise movies, I know. <laughs> um, we're getting rid of Top Gun. This one's pretty random, but this is a Pilates DVD. It's Mario Windsor Pilates, Shaun of the Dead, Talladega Nights, Turner and Hooch, Young Frankenstein, The Reduced Shakespeare Company, The Complete Works of William Shakespeare Abridged, Big Fish, Minority Report, and The Shawshank Redemption. Then, ugh, I'm pretty sure all of these are Disney DVDs in these tote boxes. I don't know if we're getting rid of these tote boxes. I feel like we probably don't need them. We bought them specifically for our Disney DVD collection. A lot of these are not opened. The Adventures of Ichabod and Mr. Toad. Oliver and Company, not opened. Um, Saludos Amigos and the Three Caballeros, not opened. Make My Music is not opened. We have Brave. Toy Story 3 is not opened. And then I'm just gonna hold these up. I'm not gonna take them all out because they're all in here. But yeah, Toy Story 1 and 2 are also in here. The Black Cauldron, The Little Mermaid, Fox and the Hound 1 and 2, they're combined into one um, case. Snow White and the Seven Dwarves, Pinocchio, Dumbo, Bambi, Fun and Fancy Free, Peter Pan, The Lady and the Tramp, Sleeping Beauty, The Sword in the Stone, 101 Dalmatians, The Jungle Book, The Aristocats, The Many Adventures of Winnie the Pooh, Robin Hood, and Fantasia and Fantasia 2000, which are combined into one. And then the second tote, um, we have the Lego Movie. I know that's not Disney, but it's thrown in here. Finding Nemo, which is unopened. Mary Poppins, which is unopened. How to Train Your Dragon 2 and How to Train Your Dragon 1. Um, the second one is not opened. And yes, I realize these are not Disney movies, but that's how it goes. Space Jam, Frozen, Ugh. it's fine, didn't drop it. Oh, I'm gonna keep these in here. 
so I don't totally take everything out. The Great Mouse Detective, Melody Time, Rescuers, and The Rescuers Down Under, which is combined into one case. Beauty and the Beast, Aladdin, The Lion King, Pocahontas, and Pocahontas 2 combined into one disc, not disc, case. Hunchback of Notre Dame, Hercules, Mulan, and Mulan 2 also combined. Tarzan, Lilo and Stitch, Brother Bear, Home on the Range, The Princess and the Frog, and Wreck-It Ralph. And then I'm also getting rid of Tangled. I don't have it in here, um, but I do want to watch it one more time before we sell it. But if any of you want to buy it, I'll watch it really fast and then sell it to one of you guys. All right, so those are all the DVDs that we are getting rid of, that we're selling. That's a lot, I know. These are music books because we're getting rid of our instruments. Uh, this is a piano book. I'm not selling these, by the way. Well, we are selling the instruments, so maybe I'll just give these to whoever wants to buy the instruments, which we're going to be posting on either Craigslist or Facebook Marketplace, by the way, so I'm not selling them to any of you guys. I really don't want to deal with shipping of those things. But we have um, this violin book, this violin book, and this violin book, and then that piano book that we are getting rid of. This is a violin that we are getting rid of. I'm not even going to bother opening it. You probably believe me that it's a violin. You see this guitar that we are selling and this keyboard that we are selling. Um, so yeah, those instruments, I'm gonna try and sell for just a little bit, just to make a little bit of money. And this is a music stand that we'll probably just give away to whoever um, is buying the instruments. This is like a petticoat kind of thing that I wore with my wedding dress to make the skirt more full. Um, I'm giving that to whoever wants to buy my wedding dress. This is my wedding dress. I There is a, a used wedding dress website where you can post your wedding dress to sell. So I just, I don't need it. Like, I don't need it. I got to wear it twice. It was amazing. Not that I got married twice, but I had a ceremony separate from a reception. So I got to wear it twice. And it's been like professionally cleaned and sealed and it comes with the veil like I don't know I just don't need it in my life anymore so I'm really looking forward to finding someone who wants to buy it for a lot cheaper than I paid for it then we've kind of gone through a little bit more of our kitchenware so there's some cups in here that we're decluttering there are four of these plain white mugs we have eight or we had eight so now we have four we're getting rid of four of these I'm getting rid of my breakfast at Tiffany's mug. I just, we have a lot of mugs and these, 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 this is just not one I reach for anymore. We're getting rid of four of these plain glass cups. Gage is getting rid of this beer pint glass thing. Full dress beauty. Is this from a beer company? This is a beer, yeah. So he just doesn't reach for this anymore. So he's getting rid of that. And then this, I guess, it's like a plastic cup that he just got. It says, pub dog, I'm a thirsty dog on the back. I don't know where he got it. <laughs> Probably from pub, pub dog. <laughs> and then these are like these metal, there are two of them. Sustained by Lagunitas IPA, as well as this Lost Coast Brewery beer glass kind of thing. And the last thing in here is my warm and cozy mug. I just am not drawn to it anymore. Okay, and then the last stuff is in here. So part of it is this hamper that we're getting rid of. So a lot of it is in this hamper. So we have a bag full of magnets that we used to collect magnets. We're minimalists now, or I'm a minimalist. Gage, would you consider yourself a minimalist? I was before I married you. <laughs> he said that he was before he married me. But now that I'm a minimalist, would you consider yourself one too? Yeah. Are you're getting there? Yeah. So, um, yeah, we're getting rid of all these uh, magnets. There's like Grand Canyon magnets. Um, I have a UC Santa Barbara magnet. I have a Mount Rushmore one. A lot of Washington D.C. ones, and then like a Route 66 one. Just some. There's a Meteor Crater one. Basically, from like road trips and travels, we got these. This bowl is this like plastic bowl that I got when I was a freshman in college. It's time to get rid of it. It came, I had a cup with it, I had a plate, and those I've gotten rid of. 
it's time to get rid of the bowl. It's very old. What is this, Gage? It's one of my race shirts. Oh, it's just a t-shirt Went from one of his races. I'm getting rid of my Tone It Up lunchbox. It's pretty cheaply made. And I have another lunchbox that I've had <coughs> that I use a lot more. Um, it fits more stuff. This just I tried using it recently with the stuff that I pack. It just doesn't work. It's cute. It is super cute, but I just don't like it anymore. Oh, Gage is getting rid of the blue jackets manual. <gasps> really? Wow. I don't even know what this is, but it's kind of shocking because he's kept it for a long time for some reason, anyway. Um, he's also getting rid of A Book of Five Rings by Miyamoto Musashi, as well as The Art of War by Sun Tzu. Good for you, babe. Good decluttering. Then, oh, I guess here's another glass. This is from one of his runs, um, Howard County Striders Run Through the Grapevine. It's like a cheap little wine glass thing. We have plenty of wine glasses. We don't need that. All right, these are like these like vacuum space bags. Gage had gotten these for when we moved because it just helped save space when we were trying to fit a bunch of stuff in our cars, but we don't need them anymore. But here's another book, Tao Te Ching. Did I say that right? Yeah, I don't know what this is, but he's getting rid of that. And then we've gotten curtains um, and curtain rods because one of our windows upstairs or three set of three windows had no coverings and it was making our upstairs really really hot but we couldn't get this last one up because we didn't have a ladder tall enough so we just don't need this last curtain and these last rods anymore so if you watched my candle haul i'm getting rid of one of my candles as it was burning it was just like not my taste this was the show your true colors amber balsam candle and I'm not gonna force myself to smell something I don't like. This is a reusable bag. We have a lot of reusable bags. It's a pretty nice one, so it's worth like decluttering rather than just throwing out. My three pounders. Gage says I've outgrown them. <laughs> Cause like, I don't know, it's, this one was hard for me because I started out with three pound weights, but apparently I'm stronger now, so I don't need them. We have some more books, but these are my books. Um, this is a French textbook. I'm finally like giving up on trying to learn French again. There's no way I'm gonna actually set aside the time to do it. So I'm also getting rid of this Ultimate French Verb Review and Practice book. Here's another one. It's like a different edition. All right, I have the Fifth Wave Trilogy. I read this a few months ago. It was good, but not worth keeping. And then, oh yeah, my French to English dictionary. Don't need that anymore. These are shoes that I've gotten from ThreadUp and they're really cute, but I I wore them once and long-term wear, they're just not comfortable. I tried to go for a walk in them too and they're just not comfortable, so I'm just getting rid of them. Here's another, I guess, reusable bag, but it's like a little backpack kind of thing, like drawstring, I don't know. I don't even know where we got that, but getting rid of that. This is my first sports bra from, I should probably throw this out, it's kind of gross. I'll probably actually throw this out. Yeah, but anyway, it doesn't fit me right anymore. It doesn't support my, my boobies, so getting rid of that. Our TRX DVD, we got rid of our TRX, but we forgot to give this away with it, so whoops. Another book in here. I had gotten sent this for review and I just never read it. Finally, this is so random, but four butter knives. <laughs> we have a lot of butter knives, so I put these in a baggie for a while to see like, do we really need these four butter knives? And we didn't, so getting rid of those. I'll go ahead and put these with the cups. But yeah, okay, so that is what we are decluttering. Did I forget anything? I got all the big stuff. Yeah? All right, so I hope this wasn't like out of focus or anything, so I'm standing kind of far away and the lighting looks so weird. I look really pale to myself right now, so. But it's just kind of casual, letting you guys know what we're decluttering. And like I said, this is the beginning of a series. We are going to be constantly decluttering things. It's one of my resolutions to continue decluttering. So um, every month or maybe every other month, we're, there will be a video sharing with you the things that we are decluttering for that period of time. So if you're excited about that, Give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more declutters and 
minimalism related videos and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Hopefully the washing machine wasn't too loud.